Hello YouTubers, Toronto Collector here. Well, after a short hiatus, mainly because of the fact that the cord going from my phone to my computer to download my video uh, wasn't working properly and I had to wait for a couple weeks to be able to go and get a new cord so I could download a video. If you notice behind me, there is a new sign on the wall in my studio. If you saw the video called The Sign, you know exactly what that's all about. If you haven't seen the video yet, please do check it out because that I made that video before I made this one. So this is now me doing a new video, uh, the video called The Sign. I am going to be downloading it to YouTube as well as this video, downloading it to YouTube. And so if you see me in the proper order, you'll see the sign video first, uh, where I reveal where I got the sign from, Funko Sign. And then you'll see this video. Afterwards, I'm going to be downloading one after the other. Hopefully, they'll be in the right order. And as you can see, my studio here is getting a little bigger with with the Funkos. Marie and I have been doing some shopping in my short a little hiatus. I also got a box finally sent to me. Probably one of my subscription boxes sent to me here. And it's been sitting on, in my studio here waiting for me to record my unveiling. I did that video called The Sign. On my phone but I couldn't download it. I sat on my phone for a couple weeks I couldn't download it there and I couldn't do any more videos until I downloaded it because my memory was very short. So anyways I am back now so we I have a box here to, to show you here which I don't even know what it is. It's some kind of subscription there. I think it's a subscription to uh, a Funko Pop Monthly that I were probably Game of Thrones. That's my guess. Although I haven't read it there and as you can see the package slips right there which I, which I won't be uh, looking at. So Got that unveiling for you for your entertainment there. Also got an unveiling for you of some pops that we and I have purchased within the last couple weeks, sir. So please, uh, we hope you enjoy this video called "I'm Back." So, I am back, uh, fellow YouTubers. Toronto Collector is back making videos here and gonna do an unveiling here. So here we go. Yeah, my trusty box cutter knife here. I will try not to make this video too long. But there is plenty to unveil, so I will try not to make it too long for you, because I know how if I stretch things out, it can get long and boring. I might just zone out, and I don't want anybody to zone out there. So, notice I'm still wearing my fashionable camo hat, and I got my trusty box cutter kind of knife here. So, here I go with this unveiling here. Uh, like I said, I think this is uh, part of my Game of Thrones subscri monthly subscription from Funko. I think that's what it is. Been waiting for it for, for a bit to come in here. So, we'll see what happens. And I, I don't even look at the label, I don't look at the package slip there, so that's my guess that's what it is. Hopefully it is there, if not there. Maria is busy on the computer there, so... I will do the unveiling here. So I cannot see it, I cannot see it at all. But it is. I can feel... Okay, it's in packaging, bubble, bubble, bubble cut packaging. Okay, there's a single pop in there. I can feel a single pop. There goes a bubble top packaging there. And now you can see it, but I can't see it. There's a single pop. I know that. So. So. As other collectors do, I'll hold it down here so you can't see it there. So. Yes, it is a Game of Thrones. And it's. Oh, Gandry. Yeah. Well, some pronounce it Gandry, some people pronounce it Gendry. Gandry. Gandry right there. That's Gandry. Gandry, okay. Part of my Funko of the Month uh, collection from Funko Pops, right there. So I'll do the 360 for you here. Watch, I have to watch the glare on the camera there. So here's the 360. Here's the 360 for you there. So, Gandry. Gandry. This came out, I don't know why I don't have my reading glasses on. Yes, I knew, I wear reading glasses, so I don't have them on right now, but... Gandry. This is not one I buy for myself, but as I said, it's as part of the monthly Funko Pop thing from, from Funko Pop's monthly subscription thing, which I'm going to be increasing soon, so... That's that there. That's that on there. There's a couple, um, drawings for here, I want to get. Mm-hmm. I'm going to get... So, that's that one there. Uh, yesterday, I went home from work there, I, I was so eager to get Pops because I haven't had, haven't had a chance to go to the store 
last couple weeks because my work's been changing a little bit there. So I've been spending so much time at work and coming home from that and just flopping. So I was so eager to go and get some pops there before today, which is, as I record this video today, it's Saturday the 7th of September. First week back of school here in Tirana. First week back of school. Yes, the kids here in Toronto and in Canada, they go back to school after Labor Day. That's what they do. Although there's been talk about them going back to school in August, but so far it's just talk. Mm -hmm. So anyways, Thursday coming home, I was so eager to get back to see what pops were available. I popped into my local EB Games. I'm familiar with it in the States there, but I believe that's your equivalent of GameStop in the U.S. That's what I've been told. And I went in there to buy just two pops because I needed some bus for to get home. I drive a bus for a living. And I take a, a public transit bus here in Toronto to and from work. Figure that out. That's not ironic. So anyways, I went to I went to a local EB Games uh, to buy two pops. One for Maria and one for myself. Uh, just to get myself a bus fare. So I could get some money on my MasterCard. So I could buy some more pops online. Blah, blah, blah. Long story short. So I got two pops here. And they're not, they were they were in a bag, but no point in having them in a bag. So here's a little unveiling of that one here. I will warn I haven't started yet, but I started here after Thursday night. The Die Hard line. Oh, yeah. And I, I, I really like some villains there. And Hans Gruber was a very good villain in the Die Hard series. Very good villain. Here, this is one of Hans Gruber uh, uh, figures I have here. I got the Thursday night here. This one here, in particular here, he's dressed in a blazer and, and suit pants. And as you can see here, here's a 360. There, there's the other ones available there. I had, at this time, I hadn't got many more of them. So there's Hans Gruber, uh, Hans Gruber a version of, of Hans Gruber. Oh, I didn't even notice that some, some something had been, a sticker had been put by the back of the box and then take, take, taken off. Yeah, that was my fault. Oh, that was your fault? It was my fault. Oh, so I don't blame him, so I blame you. No, blame me, yeah. Well, we'll talk about that after the video. Yeah, it's okay, so 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 there's it. There's so I don't blame the store for having a damaged box. I, I blame Marie for damaging my pop. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyways, anyways, I know you didn't mean you. Anyways, that's for that's for what I got for myself. And what did I get for Maria? A line of a, 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 her famous favorite movie in the world or favorite movie series in the world. My alarm's going out there. I'll have to adjust that. Mm -hmm. Favorite uh, movie. Her favorite movie in the world is the. Harry Potter series. Harry Potter series. So, I knew I couldn't go to EB Games and just get one for myself there. So, to start her series off there, or to continue series here, the star himself, Harry Potter, Mr. Potter himself. <laughs> and uh, Marie doesn't have this one yet. I'm surprised. She, uh, We still have the owl, his owl, in my collection there, which she has to go put in her collection there. So, I got her this Thursday night. And Marie was very surprised to get this there. See, there's the 360. Hmm? You had them for me last night. Well, last time was Thursday. No, last time was on Thursday. It was Thursday night, wasn't it? Friday night. Friday night. Oh, whatever. I have been working so much, ladies and gentlemen. I'm confused about the dates. Yes, it was It was Friday night. It was last night. I went and got these pops here. Friday night, I went and got these two pops for both of us. Yeah, it was like, yeah, yeah, she's right. It was last night. Okay. In addition to that, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, in addition to that, here, here are some... Are some huh? Don't show them my jeans. Why have I shown them your jeans? No. Because they're in those bags. No. And that, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages here. Here's some more exciting pops we've got here for. Another one, another one from Rhea there. She wanted for another line that she's starting here. Aladdin the genie. With his lamp. With his, with his lamp. That's another one to start her collection there. There's a mm -hmm. 360 here. That's also going into Marie's collection. Mm -hmm. Now I got four. And another one. Is uh, well, when we went, we went to EB Games. I think it was last weekend. Last week we went, we went there, and because um, I didn't have the, we, we we went there instead of going to our main store, and so we got that. I got that for her. I also got for her. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Right here in Toronto. <laughs> we found her. Call the feds. Call Homeland Security. Call uh, Interpol. She's been found. Oh. Yay! She's been found! Call Interpol. Yeah, call Interpol. Call everybody. She's been found. She's been found. Safe and sound in Toronto. Only she's a miniature. <laughs> Anyways, Carmen San Diego. Bet you didn't thought I knew about that, did you? Hmm? 
I bought it just a hat. Okay? So anyways, here's a 360 of Common San Diego. San, Di San Diego or? San Diego. San Diego, yeah. So she's named after a state in the U.S. Where? Except not quite the same spelling, you know, because the state in the U.S. is S-A-N space Diego. Not quite the same spelling. So anyways, uh, that was bought from me here. Also, as well, so I also bought for I sometimes I do spoil it sometimes. Another one from a, a, show, a series that she just started. Aladdin! Another Aladdin pop here. This here is... Prince Ali. Prince Ali. Because I'm tight. Anyways, this is Prince Ali. Another one I bought for her, I think it was last night or so. No, it was last Saturday. Last Saturday. Okay, last Saturday. I'm getting my dates confused again. Actually, no. And then I saw a collector on YouTube who really wanted this pop, and when I saw it in the store, I immediately thought of her. Unfortunately, fellow YouTubers uh, said, said reports, but that by now that I've heard that Alex from Funko Pack uh, is no longer going to be on YouTube there. I'm very sad to hear that her and Sam had problems there, and we'll be going... Pfft. I'm very sad to hear, because I really did enjoy those videos, so Alex and Sam, if you ever do see this video... I really enjoy watching videos there. You guys inspired me to actually get into this, making videos for your entertainment there. So I'm really excited to read that you guys are going like this, Splitsville. I hope you guys can re can work it out. I really do hope you guys can work it out there. But anyways, um, one of the pops that she really wanted to get from Office Space, which I've never seen yet, was the Sticky Note Guy. Or Sticky Note Man. Yeah, that's what that's what she really wanted to get. And I remember seeing that in the video there. So I saw here again in EB Games. I said, oh, I gotta get that one. Alex really wanted that one. Not that I was gonna send it to her. Sorry, Alex. But not that I was gonna send it to you there. But you inspired, you inspired me. You inspired me to get this pop. So you inspired me. So that was yesterday. And that was last weekend. This video is already 12 minutes long. Sorry about that, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. So anyways, that's... That was last night and last weekend. This is today. This is the 7th of September. I'll, I'll be uploading this video probably either tonight or tomorrow, Sunday. So that was... Uh, make some space here. Uh, I'll pause for a second while I'll make some space. We'll be right back. Okay. And we're back here. So I had to make some space here. So <laughs> that was... The pops I just showed you were, was last night and last weekend here. Today's haul, ladies and gentlemen. Today's haul. From EB Games. EB Games. The, the, the Canadian equivalent of, I believe, um, what I said a few GameStop. minutes ago. GameStop. Thank you. GameStop. Yeah, the Canadian equivalent of GameStop here. So, uh, we went to our, our local hot, hot topic today, and unfortunately, they did get some new pops in, ladies and gentlemen, but unfortunately, we were there too late there, and just like a, a wind, they were gone. So, couldn't. Down there, so I like when we go when you go when you shop here in EB Games here in Toronto, they, they all give you a small bag or they give you a gigantic one. And so we started off with a small bag, yeah. But I figured, well, you know, give us a big one because we had another purchases there. So this is among the purchases here. This is hardware, which we don't need to look at right now. So got, we got we got other purchases there. So I, I asked the guy if he could give me a big bag there. So this is one here that Maria wanted herself, and she actually bought it herself from a new series that, that she's going to be collecting. Fraggle Rock. Fraggle Rock. Down in Fraggle Rock. <laughs> That's the guy who says it too. Yep. That's the guy who says it there too. Yeah. So, that's another one that she's going to be starting there. This is the first pop for her. So, Fraggle Rock right there. This guy, like this guy I like to make fun of. Down in Fraggle Rock. I like to make I like to make fun of him. Okay, so here is another EB Games. This is this is this was um, my this is pop mostly for me. My question is the, the bag started off being being this size, but then I knew we had the purchases there, so I asked the guy if he had a bigger bag there, so he gave us a bigger bag. So this is basically my from from my collection here. And I, st I started a series uh, of movies called Die Hard, which you which you saw a Han a, a, one of my Hans Gruber's in. So this is another one from Die Hard. Um, I don't remember this character at all here, but <laughs> this here is another one. Bianca won. She won the U.S. Open. Really? Yeah. 
the whole, the, you mean the whole the whole thing's over now? Yep, and she won it. So apparently our tennis uh, sports update from Maria. That apparently our tennis player Bianca Andreescu beat Serena Williams to win the U.S. Open. Where did it go, girl? Where did it go? Good for her. Can he win the U.S. Open? Sorry about that, fellow American. Sorry about that, Americans. I should say that's fellow Americans. Sorry about that, American friends. But can he win the U.S. Open? Isn't that ironic? And anyway, back to the Pops of Hanya. So I don't really remember this character that, that much there, but apparently he was in the movie there. So I've got one Hans Gruber figure right now. So here is da -da 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 -da, puppy. Oh, no, not yet. So here's another Hans Gruber character, and this is the one from the back of the box. You see him here. He's holding the gun on one side, and his handy talkie on the other side. This is actually right out of the movie. Here's a 360 here. So now I have him, and I have uh, I have him with the gun, and I have him being beaten up, which I just showed. So now I need I need uh, John McClane, and I need Al Powell. Those I can get online easily. So there's so my Die Hard collection is almost complete. So now I bought from Maria uh, to help her with her Harry Potter collection is Fox the Phoenix. Fox the Phoenix, because I'm tight. Yeah, how, how are you pronounce these? I'm not into Harry Potter Fox. or that kind of thing there. So this is all for me there. So here's a 360 of that one. Because I'm tight. So there's the one for her there, and uh, and uh, I did I I already did I, I already revealed him wearing a robe right. I did that the first part of the video. Okay, yeah, because it is all 60 minutes long. I'm so sorry about this, ladies and gentlemen. For those who are still here, thank you for still being here because this is a rather long video. So that's those ones there. And then, got a few more buckles here. So, another one to help out with Marie's collection from Harry Potter. Victor Crumb. Victor Crumb. I'm not sure who the heck that is there, but she knows who it is, and that's all counts. Yes. So if you're any Harry Potter fan, I'm sure you'll know who this who this character is too. So that's another one for her collection. Yep. And another one from the Mr. Harry Potter! Collection. She's the teacher. Nope. Civil something. Civil Trenly? Trenly? Whatever? I can't pronounce her name. I can't, I can't pronounce it either. So there's another one for Maria's collection right there. I'm trying to speed up here so the video is not 20 minutes long. And the last one here for her Hey Potter collection. Fleur de Cleur. Gazim type. That's her name. Okay, sounds pretty French to me. It is There's a 360 verse. So obviously her hair part collection is coming along surprisingly well, thanks to me. And, and, she, and she ends up marrying one of the, uh, Ron's brothers. And, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm happy to say that that is all the pups. That, that is this update complete there. So, uh, uh this video is now 18 minutes long there. So, I uh, thank you very, very much for hanging in there. I hope you've enjoyed this unveiling here. Toronto Collector and Maria are back now from from my little hiatus there. Now that we now that I have a, a way of downloading my phone here, so please check out my videos there. If you like the video here and I made you laugh and you enjoy, you enjoy my sign there, enjoy my new back my, my new backdrop there, please do hit the like button, do subscribe, and if you just do subscribe, which I sincerely hope you do, hit the bell icon there. I will try to do videos for you a couple times a month. Hey. Now I can't do videos every week like other people can, but I'll try to do them for you a couple times a month. But now, Tron Collector is back. So I thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned, and Tron Collector says, take care.